yes to, great the test results are positive. You have HIV. That doesn't sound very positive to me. No, well, not positive in that sense. But you do have HIV. Oh, Jesus. What does this mean? Well, it's not a death sentence anymore. Thank God. Proper diet, exercise, and some protein inhibitors, you can live a normal life. Cut teeth? Well, normal for you, I suppose. I'm going to recommend you see a specialist. His name is Dr. Brady. He's excellent. I also want to start you on a round of Trixoban. I believe I have some samples in my office. You may have stomach problems at first, but it should go away. Doctor, I work with children. Oh, right. Well, that might be a problem, but if you wear gloves and extra cautious around them, you should be fine. But what about their parents? Yeah, I imagine some of them might have a problem with this, unfortunately. But quite frankly, if you're upfront about it, responsible, you really can't discriminate against you. There are laws against it. Now, speaking of responsibility, I do have some uncomfortable questions to ask you. Yes, sir. Have you ever shot heroin? Share needles? No. I'm the tooth fairy. I don't. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Do you ever have uh, promiscuous sex with lots of men? Or women? No. I don't do that. No. <laughs> <laughs> well, if you're with your name, you might be, you know. No, Doc. That's, that's not even funny. I'm, I'm in a committed monogamous relationship. No. Well, yes. Like a rabbit. <laughs> but no, no, I, I, I don't think that's where I got it. We've been together for several years now. I, 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 okay, then in your opinion, where do you think you might have gotten this from? Well, I, I go around collecting teeth, Doctor. I'm the tooth fairy. <laughs> Some of them are not the obvious, I suppose. And you don't wear rubbers? Gloves? No, I, I get all my supply from children. The purest, cleanest little children you've ever seen. There's something magical when a child releases his first spike hospital. What gives me goosebumps? I you know that children can get AIDS as well. They're not you. They can get them from their parents or ironically enough they're dentists. I, I know that, but uh, I came top dollar for those mowers, Doc. I, I never thought. Well, sometimes I pay a quarter, depending upon the socioeconomic standpoint of the child's parents, but still, I mean, well, I, 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 I push the stand. Surely that would be helpful. No, no, Doc, you, you wouldn't understand. It's a part of me, it's who I am. It all started with this rock, only the teeth, a yard full of canines. And, Clean up the garden. I I, I tore the floor right up over it, and then I I affixed toothbrush bristles to my lawnmower, and then I made an end table out of them, and then a kitchen table, and then my sofa, and then at this point all my appliances are pure now, and it hurts to walk around lonely on the steel edge. Have you ever been tested for OCD? People in the next few years have to be here. You're often diagnosed with OCD. No. Well, bunnies. I should say I can't. It's an obsession I know, but I'm the tooth fairy, damn it! But I know who I am! It's my destiny. I see. And these wings you have on, they help you... What? Oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.
pretty weak here, Doc. I have AIDS. <laughs> no, your T cells are fine. You're at the very early stages. Actually, it shouldn't be that noticeable. Look, don't patronize me, okay? I, 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 I know I can't fly. <laughs> Nice teeth. 